everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I'm super excited. We're taking a look at Fleetwood's top of the line, highest end motorhome. This is the 2020 Fleetwood Discovery LXE Model 40D. We are gonna take a look at the outside features first, then the inside features, then we're gonna give you three things we love about this motorhome and three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. Hey everyone again, welcome back to another video. My name is Matt from Matt's RV Reviews. It's the world's only channel that gives you that true and biased review about everything when it comes to RVs. And again, today I am super excited to be taking a look at this Fleetwood Discovery LXE Model 40D. Now, before I begin, I would like to say hi to Andrea. Hey, Andrea. Hi, everyone. How's it going? It's going good. You got some ants right there. I do, I do. Ants gotta, on your feet, ants in your I pants. Gotta, I gotta get away from here. Okay, we're gonna get away from there. Uh, but before we begin, I wanna give two shout outs. One, big shout out to a company called Grip6. Look at that, they made this nice shiny belt for me. They are an American made company, and as you guys know in the last two videos, we're giving away five free Grip6 belts that look like this, bing! And congratulations to the winner of the uh, Winnebago Sunstar video, bing! Right there, send me an email, and you get a Grip6 belt. And I'll tell you more about Grip6 later. Um, so let's get started. Model is 40D, but the actual tip to tip length is 41 feet 4 inches. This is the Fleetwood Discovery LXE. They're top of the line, super badass and awesome. No propane unit, all electric. Up front here, you have your mobile eye collision mitigation system and the generators, they come and zone in 8,000 generator. This motorhome has all the bells and whistles. Coming down the side here, check this out. You have these nice big chrome bus style mirrors. You got your little lane sensor here to let you know if somebody's next to you. And then right there, it is it has the um, uh, side camera, okay? Fleetwood Motorhome, look at those tires, Andrea. Wow. This is the 275-80R 22.5. What powers this motorhome, it has a 380 Cummins, um, 380 horsepower Cummins engine with a 3000 Allison transmission. And this is a nice raised drill chassis, which means you get a lot of nice pasture storage. Also, there is Wi-Fi Ranger already installed and frameless windows throughout the whole motorhome. Now, if you back up some, sorry y'all, we're in a little tight situation here, but you see those awnings, that awning? It's the Gerard Armless awning with wind sensor. Uh, it's just a pretty interesting awning. And then right there is your fuel fill up. Okay, cool. Let me go underneath here. New for 2020 is the, um, they, they did this with the slide outs. They use the, uh, they call this the Atlas grip. What the heck is it called? Dang nabbit, I forget what they call it. But what they did was um, Fleetwood had these like keystone shapes and the doors would go down and everything. Now it's more flush. I believe it's called the Atlas chassis. Oh, look at that little slide out tray with a fridge Andrea that's cool cool it was called power bridge oh and now it's called freedom bridge that's what it's called Ooh. look at that nice pass-through storage with the slide out tray more right slide out tray you can access that on both sides over here nice Sony outside television great. I love it it's great size yep yes ma'am all right, we got more storage. Oh, nice. Wow, Andre, that's the second bedroom. I know. All right, well, I'll show that storage. I gotta get this ladder right here. Oh, I can't open that. You can't? I got you, girl. Thank you. More storage with spare tire. Wow. Where are we at? Over here? Right there. Lots of storage. This is a big old motorhome, folks. Is this your uh, power transfer switch, your solar charge for the roof, battery control center, and everything? I gotta tell you, I love the paint job on here. It is beautiful, and I feel like my outfit matches sure. the motorhome. That's been happening lately, coincidentally. Huh? 
right here's your inverter a little bit more storage and then right here again just a little bit more storage because you can never get enough nice all aluminum slam latch doors coming around the back you have a 10,000 pound hitch and this motorhome can tow 10,000 pounds you have a nice rear fiberglass cap backup camera up there and then again 380 horsepower engine and you do have a nice one-piece fiberglass roof let's go up there and take a look i gotta tell you i'm not very happy about this ladder here we go now hold on wow okay up here on the roof you have not one not two but three air conditioning units i love that look at this uh the gerard awning system it makes it more elegant so like that's a regular discovery, right? And you can see your AC units and everything. This, it kind of makes it a nice streamlined profile where you can't see what's going on on the roof. You got an air conditioning unit right up there, Wi-Fi Ranger right there, and your satellite dish and your King Air digital antenna. Please hold on. I got it. Slow. I'm here. Oh my God. I'm gonna invest in a drone. No drones. I don't care, I'll buy what I want. <laughs> Great, and if you haven't already, make sure you smash that thumbs up button. What did RV salesman's gonna take his fat ass up on the roof? Show you what features the roof has to offer. Nobody. Nobody. And we ain't getting no drone, neither. We'll see about that. Over here, look at all these batteries, Andrea. Wow. Batteries on palm batteries. Oh man, they're the Harris Professional Plus. Nice. That's the good brand. Never heard of that brand. Over here's where you fill up your DEF. More batteries. Awesome. More batteries. Love okay. the doors on here. Yeah, very nice. Okay. Other side. Oh, Wet look bay. At this. Yep. Very clean, very nice, very professional. That's an $800 stinky slinky we got added there and everything. Beautiful. Yes, ma'am. This is just the other side of your pass-through storage, okay? <laughs> okay. <a> jerk. <laughs> and then, look at this. Wow. This is your Aquahop 400D. Uh, this is your water heater. This has the heated tile floors and everything. It's the nice. good one, folks. And then right here is just a little bit more electronical no more storage and then that's your pull out for your generator again Cummins only an 8,000 generator well Andrea the outside of this motorhome looks great but the inside looks even better let's go take a look oh I can't wait to see this oh dang nabbit batteries are running low Okay, that's all right. I'll get up there. I know. Hang on a second. Dang, nab it, Andrea. Can you do it? Good job. Can you do it? Andrea, <laughs> you know I'm the more athletic one out of all, all of us. All right. You ready, you ready for this? Watch this. No hands. No hands. No. Oh, my gosh. Oh. <laughs> Almost didn't make it. All right. Wow. Cool. Oh my gosh. Now, while we're walking through this motorhome, again, Half big shout out to Grip6. They are an American-based company out of Utah. Show the bathroom, show the bathroom. This is so beautiful. They're an American-based company out of Utah. Oh. Yeah, that's nice. Don't show too much. Don't I'm show not, much. I'm not. They're out of Utah, and I saw their commercial, which was hilarious. And um, I reached out to them saying, hey, I want to help support them. Give me a couple free belts for my subscribers. And uh, give me one for me that says Matt's RV Reviews. Thank you so much. And I'll promote you. So if you need a new belt, this is great. Check out the commercial and go to grip6.com. And make sure you tell Matt from Matt's RV where he sent you. We don't get anything. We just want to know. Cool. Up front here, Andrea. Let's get wow. started. This chassis here. It's just a Freightliner chassis, okay? It's a telescoping steering wheel. That means it goes up and down, in and out. For all those fat people, you know what I'm saying? We need that steering wheel a little bit in. You got your cup holders here, keyless entry, 
right? You know what I'm saying? You turn this stuff on and, oh, not that. Like it has a screen there. Yep, very nice. And a screen here. Yep. We'll see the dang old. Somebody left the dang old lights on and that's why nothing's working. But you got your screen here. It's the mobile eye, lets you know the speed of the road that you're in and everything. Andrea, would you want to sit in my co-captain seat? Sure. Now, as you guys can see, the little thing's already out because somebody didn't pay attention and they left it out, but it is power seat. Nope, oh, nope. Oh yeah, that's why. It's a power and, seat. And hey, yep. okay, let, let me just tell everybody, because we're low on batteries here, but I had people questioning about the stairwell. There is a cover, as you can see, right in there. You would push a button and that goes over like a piece of flooring, so you're not gonna fall down that stairwell. Yep, and Andrea, what's the cargo carrying capacity? 3,342 pounds. Oh man, that's nice. You do have a TV? Yep, you got your TV, you got a little bit of cabinetry here. I think they slide, don't they? Yeah. Slide to the left. Slide okay. to the right. There you go. Right. There you go. You got your weed boost and everything. And guys, we have a bunk over the cab. Yep, bunk over the cab. It does hold. 500. 500 pounds. 600. Where do you see five? Right there. 500 pounds. Yes. The high loft. And then both seats do swivel. But I will say honestly, they, they, they don't work that well. At least not this one with this particular floor plan. But I mean, this living room area is absolutely I love it. fantastic. I love that L shaped yeah, sofa. Yeah, this L shaped sofa. Well, not. It's not just that I love it, okay? Well, one, I love it. It's comfortable, right? But two, I love how it's directly across from the TV and fireplace. Yes. It's oh, yes, definitely. Elegant, nice. Check out these windows here. We have your MCD daytime shades and privacy shades. Oh, very nice. You got cabinetry above. Uh huh. Did yes, you open those? Of course, hidden hinge cabinetry. Nice. Only the finest for the yellow. And Matthew, this this is the one that goes in. This is like on the like how it is on the bounders, right? Yes. That extend that yes. extends out. So and you don't then, have to have that out if you don't want to. No, and then look, there's like a little remote holder. Wow. Thing. Very nice. And so I believe that there is a is it a recliner? Yeah. Um, I don't think it's like a recliner. Oh no, you know what? Yeah, it is. It's yeah, the footrest. I a mean, footrest. Right? Yes. Not a recliner. That's what I meant. But very okay. nice and then across this one of the few motorhomes that gives you the table and chairs a lot of people like this this is nice it's just more sophisticated look you have a little oh, office little thingy nice. to do so yep. you have a little workstation yep you got your balances and your daytime nighttime shades MCD i love shades, that window privacy shades everything now matt underneath this table there is some cabinetry oh Wow, look at this. Under there. Yep. Adjustable shelf. Adjustable shelf. We got a drawer here. Nice drawer. And then there is more cabinetry down there. Uh-huh. Plenty of cabinetry. You have a uh you uh electrical outlet here. Yep. Your light switch. Yep. And then Yep, let's show the TV. Got cabinetry above. Very nice. Blu-ray, TV splitter and everything. Very nice. Here's all your electronical controls, tank flows, auto gen start, air conditioning, and everything. Look how big that TV is. Very nice. That's a huge TV. You got your Bose sound system, and then look right there, Andre. It does have an electric fire. Now, I got to say, I love these floors. Porcelain tile, snap stone flooring, heated floors because the alcohol 400D. But, Andrea, it's now time for the MSRP. Burr, 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 burr. MSRP on this motorhome is. Let's hear it. Three hundred and eighty-six thousand. Wow. One hundred thirty-four dollars MSRP. Sale price we have it thirty-three percent off to two fifty-nine nine ninety-five. Wow. That is a phenomenal price. But I can get you a better price than that. Andrea, enough nonsense. Tell everybody how we do it. <laughs> you can call, you can text, you can email, you can FaceTime. Hey, 301-906-0962 or mattsrvreviews at gmail.com or check out our website, mattsrvreviews.com where you can get your official Matt's RV Review sticker, bing, right up there. And um, there's also a contact me page on our website. Andrea, 
let's continue the video. Oh, but before we do, I got one last thing to say. So this is the Fleetwood Discovery LXE. It's Fleetwood's top of the line, but Fleetwood's owned by Rev Group. You know who else is owned by Rev Group, Andrea? Holiday Rambler. Well, do you know who else else? No, who? American Coach. Oh. Which American Coach starts, has like the dream and the heritage and the, the tradition. Eagle. The Eagle, yeah. And they start where the LXE um, stops, right? And we just became an American Eagle, American Coach, American Coach dealer at our Tampa store. So leave down in the comments wow. below. Let us know if you want Matt and Andrea to take a trip down to Tampa, 77 miles down to Tampa, and record some American coaches um, for you guys. Let us know. <laughs> I don't know, Matt. I would love to do that. Well, I'm only doing it if people hashtag <laughs> run, Andrea, run. Oh. Oh, hashtag run Andrea run. I like yes, that. Yes, yes. And and um, <laughs> if you hashtag run Andrea run, that's also how you'll enter to win the uh, grip six belt for this episode. Yes. Okay, show show <laughs> All the All right, so run Andrea run. <laughs> so we're gonna start here with the cabinet, adjustable cabinet, very nice. Uh huh. I got a comment, guys. I love this backsplash. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful color. The, the the gray tone. Solid surface countertops. Uh huh. Um, let's see. Oh, Ooh. we got the two induction yeah. top here. Very nice. These things are so heavy. I just don't know why they put these in here. All right, so I'm gonna go back over here. Oh, you Look, gotta, we push, gotta push with your thumb. We got this little island peninsula. Oh, here. that's a pull-out <laughs> peninsula. <laughs> we got drawers. Three of them, Matt. You didn't even count, but they're hard to open. Two. And three, three draws, Andrea. Yes. Great Thank job. Thank you, Matthew. Thank you. Oh, look at this. People are going to love this. I'm not going to show them just yet. We got another shelf or cabinet here. Uh huh. Got a drawer here. Uh huh. And Andrea, what is that? That's a dishwasher. No way. That is so cool. Yay. So rarely do RVs come with dishwashers now. It's true. You only see them in the higher, higher ends. Have you missed. Cabinet. You missed. Oh. Did I miss the Whirlpool convection yeah, oven? Yeah, microwave, microwave convection oven. Wow, this heat's getting to me. That's <laughs> a heat wave, Andrea. It is a heat wave. It's not a heat wave, it's just it's heat wave head. in here. Heat wave in here. Yep. All right, love these, I love the countertop. I like the farmhouse sink. Beautiful sink. Very pretty. Recessed in. Yes. Beautiful thingy-madoo. Thingy-madoo. This, yeah. this is just nice. It's a thingy-madoo, is that it? Yeah, just a okay. thingy-madoo. Guys. Will you please leave in the comments below? Let me know what this is called because I know it's not a thing I'm gonna do. Well, what? I, I honestly don't. I, I want to ask what it. Well, yeah, but I need. I want the technical term. Oh. And we got a trash can. Oh, that's an eighty-three dollar trash can. Yeah. Very nice. Awesome. Take a look up here at this light fixture. Uh huh. Very pretty. Very nice. Across we have the beautiful residential refrigerator. Andrea. Yes. Is this light fixture Art Deco? No. <laughs> oh, okay. Beautiful Whirlpool residential refrigerator runs uh -huh. off your inverter. Yeah. And a nice freezer. Mm, very and nice. And I do really like this. The glow. It's got a nice feng shui. Oh, feng shui. Doesn't it? Yes. I love I like it. It looks glow. good. It just it looks nice. And I want to comment on the LED lights underneath the kitchen cabinet. No, 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 the pantry. Oh, there's LED lights in there too. Yes. Can you nice. see? Nice. Nice. Very nice. What's that over there? And the pantry. Uh-huh. Oh, look, my favorite. Oh, nice. Drawers. You got five of them in there. Ba-doom, 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 ba-doom. Ba okay. And then, um, what's that there? Show that. I'm so excited. Yes! Look at that. Stackable. Beautiful. Whirlpool washer and dryer. Okay. What a great thing. I know they want me to take the camera back. <laughs> what, 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 what a beautiful motorhome. Yes. Look at that pocket door on okay. that bathroom. I like it. Interesting. I, I like it. Andrea. Oh, wow. I can just tell. Wow, this, this is, is hey, beautiful. Andrea, this is why I wake up in the morning. <laughs> oh, I know. This, oh my God. This is gorgeous. This is the primest of pooping positions. It's the perfect height. I'm comfortable. I got plenty of space. It is very, very Tell nice. The holder's in a great spot. Yep. Okay, so here we go with the medicine cabinet. Oh, yeah. Great space. Uh-huh. We have the mirror there, as you can see on the corner. You got another cabinet here. Very nice. Uh, you got a fan up there, guys. Uh -huh, Max Air fan. We got cabinets here above. Oh no, sorry, nope. I lied. But I like how it's covered Yeah, up. that's like your fuse box. Yep, very nice. I do like that it has two towel holders in here. Mm-hmm. 
I gotta say, the backsplash looks great. It does. And I really like that it gives you counter space in there. I just love the colors in here. Me too. Okay, in the master bedroom. Look There's at that. There's one Plenty wardrobe. Uh-huh. Here's the other wardrobe. Very oh, nice. look, very cute. They actually put three drawers down there. Yep, very smart. The TV's back here. Got storage behind the TV. Yep. And then you got four drawers there. Mm. Nice. There's all your remotes. And you got a window there, which I like a lot. Yep. Okay, very nice. And then over here's the tilt of view bed. This is a king size. King bed, yep, tilt of view. You got plenty of storage, right? I do like this. You can control your lights and everything underneath. underneath. And then wow. this is a camera selector. So if you're watching TV and you want to, and somebody's knocking on your door, you oh, can click that to see who's at the side of your wow. door. Wow. So a pretty it's got cool like feature. a little security. Like that's not like a security thing. Yeah, yeah. And I like the windows there. Nice uh -huh. cross breeze. Guys, mm. look at that picture. That oh my is God. beautiful. Art Deco. <laughs> Whoa, look at that. That's speakers. Wow. I didn't even know on that. both sides. Yeah. It does give you a little nightstand there with your USB ports on both sides. Also, if you guys notice, uh, this is the Whisper Quiet air conditioning system. Wow. Cool. I'm very impressed. Cool. Inside the master bathroom. Oh, look at the tile. This is a hold beautiful on, hold on. shower. Look at that. Look at, mm. oh my goodness. Look at those tiles. Very nice. Beautiful. Beautiful. Good height in there. Yep. yep. No um, seat. That, that's the only thing I, I'd have to say. Yep, I concur. Here's your sink over here. With lots of mirrors and cabinets for all of your medicines. <laughs> your viewers are going to be like, what is he on? Nothing. Look at that. That's yep. beautiful. I love how it has that extra... Little thingy? Yeah, whatever it's called. I just it's called can't a thingamadoo. Think, thingamadoo. I can't think straight right now, but okay. this is very nice. And you guys, you know, everybody always probably wants to wonder what's underneath there. That's your engine. Engine access compartment. Oh, See, this is weird. wait, hold Oops, on. Sorry. You're in my way. Watch sorry. out. Okay, See, this so. this is weird because it looked like it was prepped for a stackable washer dryer. Yeah. Stackable washer dryers in there. I don't know why they use these doors. That's strange. Oh, and there's your other two chairs for yep. your table. If you have gas. You have the window there. And yep. I gotta say, I'm not a fan of the balances in here. I like the fan up there. Yep. Oh, look at the toilet. Let's see. All right, it's now time for the toilet test part two. I mean. Man, I think this might get the eight P's. Eight. Eight P's. Beautiful eight P's. Fleetwood. Porcelain prom pooping positions. For those of you who don't know, now you do know. It's porcelain prom pooping position. Look at that. Toilet paper holder placement. Very nice. Andrea, how much power do we have left? Um, 9%. Dang it. Well. And it is on a pocket door, guys. Yep, very nice. Beautiful. It, it's got two. Yep. Two of them here. Okay, so let's... Well, Andrea, that's it. That's the review. It's now time we give you three things we love about this motorhome and three things we dislike about it. Andrea, what should we do first? We're doing three things we dislike about it. Okay, first... I'm gonna say, I'm gonna go first, Andre. I'm gonna say this tilt of view bed. You got, I mean, so so here's the deal, right? When you're at this level, it's gonna be very, very hard for us to find dislikes. I don't even know what we're gonna dislike about the American coaches, but the tilt of view bed, it's never been our thing. We don't like how it tilts up because uh, Andrea likes to lay in the bed while we're driving down the road. Um, that's just a dislike and, you know, we gotta find three. Andrea, two. Okay, so I had already commented earlier. I don't like these balances. I just really think they look funny. How, they, they look weird. Weird, like I mean, is it like a deal breaker? Weird no, or like? It's not, of course, it's not a deal breaker. This but, motor home is beautiful. I just think this is one of the things I strongly dislike. Okay, is the balances. Really? Yes. That's interesting. So that's two, and then number three, I'm gonna say this. This, oop, follow me, follow me, <laughs> follow me. So this is what controls your awnings. And I think that's so stupid. I really wish, see this awning? That's for the door awning. I wish the awning had a button right here so you could do it both ways. The slide outs, you have double buttons. You can get the slide outs done this way and on that digital screen right there. And I wish there was two ways to put the awning in and out. 
because I know I would lose this remote and it would be very annoying. <laughs> Let me put this back before put, I lose it. Can't you put the awning out on the digital nope. pad? No? Oh, that is a bummer. Yeah. Great. So that's three things we dislike about it. Now it's time for three things we love about this motorhome. Andrea, do you want to go first? Where do I begin? Well, with your first love. I, I, I just don't know. I just, I love Fleetwood. Okay? Yes. So look, I got to say, guys, I am in love with the kitchen and especially the dishwasher. Yes. Just everything about this yes. kitchen. This I love awesome. the backsplash, the dishwasher, yes. the pull-out peninsula, the plenty LED of countertop lights. space, an actual microwave convection oven that's big enough that you can use. Yes. The residential fridge. It's just very, very nice. And look at this decor. I mean, they yep. did a great job. So two, I'm going to say this porcelain tile floor. It's absolutely beautiful. I love the gray look. Not only that, with the Aquahot 400D, you have the option to get the heated tile floor. Now listen, that's an option. So you wanna make sure, you know, if that's a big deal for you, if you like to go to cold areas, that you get that option. So that's two, and then three, you or me? You. Follow me. Follow me. Oh, we gotta sneak through here. Good, good. And then the third thing I absolutely love about this motorhome is just because it's so unique. Well, one, I love the pass-through storage. That is so awesome. But I love the little refrigerator core on the slide-out tray. That's just so cool and unique, and you don't see that on every motorhome. Great, well that's it, that's the review. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions about this motorhome, please call me, text me, send me an email. It is mattsrvreviews at gmail.com or 301-906-0962 is my cell number or check out our website, mattsrvreviews.com where you can get your official Matt's RV Review sticker. Bing! And, um, and guess what, Andrea? Yeah. Tomorrow, we're coming out with another video and it will be our 50th, 50,000th subscriber video coming out tomorrow. Woohoo! Thank you so much, everyone. We thank you so much, guys. You're awesome. Andre, do you have anything you want to say? Yes. Hey, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. Let us know the three things that you like about this RV and the three things that you dislike. Fleetwood does read our comments, and I can't wait to see what you guys all have to say about it. Also, I hope everybody's doing well and you guys are staying safe. Yep. Thanks, guys. 50,000! Woohoo! Woo also, big shout out to Grip6 for making me that custom belt. And again, hashtag um down in the comments below. What were run, we saying? Andrea, run. run, Andrea, run! Run, Andrea! Run, Andrea! <laughs> run! Hashtag that down in the description below to win a free belt. Also, links to Grip6 if you want to buy a belt yourself down in the description below. Thanks so much for watching. Andrea, we'll, we'll see you! you.